This is exam one for ECE 201. This is a closed book, closed notes test, and you should have completed the videos up to and including page 43 of chapter two. If you haven't done that, don't look at this exam until you've studied that material. Let's go over the questions in the test and then you'll have 60 minutes to work on it. The first problem, given the plot of current shown here, flowing past the reference point versus time, Plot the charge transferred past this reference point versus time if the initial condition of charge is zero. Label levels and maximums and minimums. Problem number two, can you find the current I1, the current I2, and the voltage V for this circuit? Question 2b, can you find the resistance looking back into the circuit for R1, looking back for R2, R3, R4, and then eventually R equivalent. For problem number three, can you find the voltage V2, V3, the current I2, which is here, and the resistances R1, R2, and R3? For the second part of this, can you use your results from part A and find the power absorbed by each element in the circuit, and then find the sum of the absorbed power? And lastly, for problem four, can you do a source transformation and convert this current source and parallel resistance into a voltage and a resistance with the polarity shown here? And then problem 4b, given a delta, can you find the resistor R sub x in the y? And this is exam number one. You can find a copy of this exam by looking in the ECE 201 ebook bookmarks towards the end. Print a copy of this exam out and you have 60 minutes to do the exam.